I really think we're gonna start to see the divorce rates just fucking skyrocket. Because it seems like women who are married to men are having a reckoning. I think a lot of it has to do with TikTok. But they're starting to realize that, you know, not only do their husbands like not like even like them or even, or know them, but they actually have it worse off than their fucking moms. I actually had a friend say to me recently, and, and, and she's married to a very progressive man in theory. But when she looked at her parents' relationship, her dad worked, her mom was uh, raised the kids. There was at least some sort of division of labor where like they knew their roles. Like the way she explained it to me, she is involved in every fucking task in the home. There is nothing she's not involved in. Even his tasks, somehow she gets looped into. And this is actually a very progressive man too. And so what I think a lot of women are realizing is that because these these things are not like really outlined, who's doing what? Fair play, if you don't have it, buy the fucking book. It's saving marriages or causing divorces based on how invested the men are in that book. But I wanna show, I wanna, there's a beautiful piece out in the cut this week. Uh, it's by Maggie Smith. I was able to read it, uh, even though there may be a paywall, but I think you can maybe read a couple articles for free. And she's basically a writer, very talented writer, married with kids. And she had a poem go viral. And from that moment on, she realized her husband fucking sucked. She started getting opportunities to talk more and travel. And every time she traveled, he punished her somehow for it. Whether it was, you know, having a bunch of shit to come home to or making her feel guilty for not being there, bad for going on these amazing opportunities for her career, these trips that would, you know, give her, launch her career even more. He didn't want that. Because at the end of the day, men who are not deconstructing patriarchy, they see themselves as the sun and we just fucking orbit around them. And that's why they're jealous of their kids because the fucking kid is born and now it's like, wait a second, King Baby wants a bottle too. If a woman's career takes off, wait a second, what about me? And what was heartbreaking in that piece is that when she went to this event, she saw other women there whose husbands were there with them to support them. Or they like one guy tried to take a photo of her and was like, oh, you should send that to your husband or offered to send it, be like to show her, you know, in her glowing, in her fucking creative prime. She's like, no, 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 that'll make it worse. Don't ever be married to a man who not only doesn't want to see you succeed, but actively wants you to fail. That's a king baby.